All right, some breaking news coming in after the Congress and the JDS approach the Supreme Court over appointment of KG Bopaya as the pro tem speaker. The court is now all set to hear the plea yet again against the pro tem speaker this time at 10.30 a.m. on Saturday morning. Remember, the Congress and JDS already are claiming that the governor did not follow the procedure in appointing the pro tem speaker as it should have been and ignored the senior most candidate as his procedure and the name that was of R.B. Desh Pandey then, who is also a Congress legislator. All right, let me go across to India today's legal correspondent, Anusha Soni. Anusha, what uh, can we expect uh, in the court on Saturday morning? What is likely to happen? It's indeed going to be a 2020 match, 10 uh, 30 a.m. That's when the Supreme Court bench sits to decide whether the appointment of Protem Speaker was correct or not. And at 11 a.m., that's when the Assembly convenes and the Speaker, the Protem Speaker, will start administering the oath to these newly appointed MLAs. Before the Supreme Court are the prayers of the Congress that it's a politically motivated, vitiated process by the BJP to completely subvert the process of law. What the Congress is arguing is that on the floor of the House, it's not going to be a fair procedure, but rather something uh, which will circumvent the entire procedure. There would be uh, some sort of sponsorship from the Speaker sitting there ensuring that there is cross-voting. So clearly there are uh, motivations which are being attributed to, this, uh, to the Speaker uh, in this case. We need to see if the Apex Court decides to intervene in this matter. The same bench led by Justice Sikri, Justice Bobde and Justice Ashok Bhushan will decide this case. If at all the Apex Court interferes, this is going to be yet another twist in the matter. 10.30 a.m. Once again, the ball is in the court of the top court. After trying to convince their politicians and legislators in hotels in different cities, now breaking news coming in that Congress and JDS MLAs have left from the Novotel Hotel in Hyderabad to reach Bengaluru for the floor test. Now the MLAs are returning to Bengaluru by a bus while Kumara Sami is taking a chartered flight because remember just a few days back uh, many of those flights even could not fly and that is why probably it seemed road is the best route. Now this following Supreme Court's order to conduct the test on Saturday. So clearly while the parties are only hopeful that their MLAs are going to abide by that specific party, the question will be, will there be legislators who will cross vote? That remains the biggest test for both the Bharatiya Janata Party, the Congress and the JDS. Let me go across to Mayuresh for further details. So Mayuresh, at least MLAs of one party heading back to Bengaluru and are they hopeful? that there will be no cross-voting. So that this uh, newly forged alliance is fully confident that uh, they will, uh, they have the numbers and uh, tomorrow it will, they will prove it. But I uh, just wanted to uh, tell our viewers that uh, three, uh, two to three buses uh, have left uh, Hyderabad towards uh, Bangalore at three different, uh, two to three different times basically not together. And they're carrying the JDS and Congress MLAs together. Uh, it's almost uh, 550 kilometers distance that is that it will take eight to nine hours uh, to reach them at Bangalore. But we have been given to understand that before reaching Bangalore, they will be uh, shifted to some resort outside Bangalore city. And after that, uh, uh, somewhere around 10:30 okay. in the morning, they will be uh, they will be taken to the Vidhan Sabha where at 4 p.m. Uh, Rappa will be facing uh, this big uh, litmus test. All right, Mayuresh, uh, keep an eye. I'll come back to you for further details. Big day on Saturday. Finally, the floor test happening after the Karnataka poll results. A day ahead of the crucial floor test in Karnataka, the Congress party has now released an audio clip where mining baron Janardhan Reddy is allegedly trying to lure Congress MLA from Raichu Rural. Now, clearly at this juncture, it appears that he was offering money to Basav Nagara Dadal and uh, the BJP, though, has hit back at the Congress, claiming that this was the doing of the Congress and their dirty tricks department. Listen in to the audio clip, this time officially released by the Congress party. Hello. 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 <laughs> Good, good, eh? 
ರಾಷ್ಟ್ರೀಯ ಅಧ್ಯಕ್ಷರೇ ಕುತ್ಕೊಂಡು ಮಾತಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ನಮ್ಗೆ ಏನು ಪದವಿ ಬೇಕು ಏನ್ ಬೇಕು ಅನ್ನೋದನ್ನ ಒನ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಮಾತಾಡಿ ಆಮೇಲೆ ನಾವು ಮುಂದಕ್ಕೆ ಹೆಜ್ಜೆ ಇಡೋಣ ಇಲ್ಲ ಇಲ್ಲ ಸರ್ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ಈಗ ನಾನು ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಪರಿಸ್ಥಿತಿ ಕೆಳಗ್ ಬಂದಾಗ ಈಗ ಅವ್ರು ಹಿಡಿದು ನಮಗೆ ಮಾಡಿದಾರ ಒಂದೇ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಹೇಳ್ತೀನಮ್ಮ ನೋಡಿ ಬಾ ಬಿ ಎಸ್ ಆರ್ ಟೈಮ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ತುಂಬಾ ಕೆಟ್ಟಿಗಳಿಗೆಯಲ್ಲಿ ಸಾಮಾನ್ಯ ಪಾರ್ಟಿ ಮಾಡಿತ್ತು ಮತ್ತು ತುಂಬಾ ವಿರೋಧವಾಗಿರುವಂತ ವಾತಾವರಣದಲ್ಲಿ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದು ನೀವೆಲ್ಲ ನಂಬಿಕೊಂಡು ಆಸೆಗಳು ಕಲ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ರ ಅನ್ನೋದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ಎರಡನೇ ಮಾತೇ ಇಲ್ಲ ನಾನು ಹೇಳ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀನಿ ನೀನು ಅದಕ್ಕಿಂತ ನೀನು ನೂರರಷ್ಟು ಬೆಳೆಯುವಂತೇನೆ ಈಗ ಅವನು ಶಿವನಗೌಡ ನಾಯಕ ಅವತ್ತು ಏನ್ ನನ್ನ ಮಾತು ಕೇಳಿ ಅವನು ಬಂದು ಮಂತ್ರಿ ಆಗಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಉದ್ದಾರ ಆಗಿದ್ದೆ ಇವತ್ತು ನಿಮಗೆ ತನ್ನಂತಿಗೆ ತಾನು ಇವತ್ತು ಸಾಯೋವರೆಗೂ ಎಮ್ ಎಲ್ ಎ ಅದಷ್ಟು ದುಡ್ಕೊಂಡು ಶಕ್ತಿವಂತರಾಗಿ ಜನ ಇಲ್ಲ ನನ್ನಿಂದನೇ ಲಾಗಿದ್ದು ಹೇಳಿ ರಾಜಗೌಡ ನನ್ನಿಂದನೇ ಲಾಗಿದ್ದು ದುರದೃಷ್ಟ ನಮ್ಮ ಬ್ಯಾಟ್ ಟೈಮ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ನಿಮ್ದು ಮ್ಯಾಚ್ ಆಗ್ಲಿಲ್ಲ ನಮಗೆ ನಿಮಗೆ ಬಟ್ ಇವತ್ತು ಏನಂದ್ರೆ ಶಿವಣಗೌಡ ನಾಯಕ್ ಗೆದ್ದು ಪ್ರಯೋಜನ ಇಲ್ಲ ಇವತ್ತು ನೀನ್ ಮಂತ್ರಿ ಆಗ್ತೀವಿ ಅರ್ಥ ಆಯ್ತಮ್ಮ ನಾನು ಇನ್ನೊಂದು ಏನಂದ್ರೆ ನಾನು ಹೇಳೋದು ಇನ್ನೊಂದಲ್ಲ ನೀವು ನೇರವಾಗಿ ನಾವು ದೊಡ್ಡವರ ಹತ್ರನೇ ನೇರವಾಗಿ ನಿಮ್ಮನ್ನ ಒನ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ನಾನು ಕೂಡಿಸಿ ನಾನೇ ಸ್ವತಃ ಮಾತಾಡಿಸಿ ಇದು ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ಮತ್ತು ಈ ದೇಶದಲ್ಲಿ ಇವತ್ತು ಅವ್ರು ಏನ್ ಆಡಳಿತ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದಾರೆ ಆ ಮಾತು ನಿಲ್ಸ್ಕೊಳ್ಳುವಂತ ಅವ್ರ ಆಗಿರೋಕ್ಕೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ನಾನು ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ನೀನ್ ಏನ್ ಆಸ್ತಿ ಗೀಸಿ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡೆ ಅಲ್ಲ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನೀನ್ ನೂರರಷ್ಟು ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂತಿ ಬಸವಂಗೌಡ ನೂರಷ್ಟು ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂತಿ ಇಲ್ಲ ಸರ್ ಸಾರಿ ಸರ್ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ನನಗೆ ಈಗ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಪರಿಸ್ಥಿತಿ ಒಳಗೆ ಇವತ್ತು ನನ್ನ ಕರ್ಕೊಂಡು ಹೋಗಿ ಇವತ್ತು ಟಿಕೆಟ್ ಕೊಡಿಸಿ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಅವರೇ ಮಾಡಿದಾರ ನಾಯಕರೆಲ್ಲ ಇಂತ ಪರಿಸ್ಥಿತಿ ಒಳಗೆ ನಾವು ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ದ್ರೋಹ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರಾಗ ಅರ್ಥ ಇಲ್ಲ ಹಂಗಾಗಿ So charges of horse trading also continue. We'll wait and watch. Will the BJP manage to take MLAs from the Congress, JDS or will the Congress, JDS finally form the government? Thanks for watching the video. For more such news and updates, please like, share and subscribe to India Today. Also check out our other great videos from our channel, We Know You Would Love To.